welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very exciting announcement. I am going to be co-hosting the Hello Seasons readathons. Basically, we just had so much fun hosting the Hello 2022 readathon at the beginning of the year, and we just had so much fun reading with you guys that we have decided to do four more readathons throughout this year, each one celebrating the four seasons. So the hosts of this readathon are as follows, and this may change a little bit depending on the time of the year and what the hosts are able to participate in. Uh, but we have Sarah, who is the creator of this readathon, and she has also created the graphics. Um, so a huge thank you to Sarah. We also have Kayla, Ruby, Kristen, Bianca, Kiara, and Laura, and myself, and Ellie, Luna, and Hugo. Okay, so now getting into how do these readathons work. So we have four 48-hour readathons throughout this year. We will be having one in March, June, September, and December. So which prompts you will use will depend on which season you are welcoming. So the Northern and Southern hemispheres are different. So if you are in the Northern hemisphere, you will be welcoming in spring for the month of March. So for that, you will want to use the spring prompts. And if you are welcoming in autumn during the month of March, you will want to use the autumn prompts. And that is why for the month of March, we have called this the Hello Spring Autumn Readathon. So the dates for the readathons are as follows. We have the Hello Spring Autumn Readathon, March 19th through 20th. We have the Hello Summer Winter Readathon from June 25th to June 26th. And we have the Hello Autumn Spring Readathon, which is September 17th through 18th. And last but not least, we will have our final readathon, which is the Hello Winter Summer Readathon from December 17th through the 18th. We will also be having reading sprints like we did for the Hello 2022 readathon. Um, those were so much fun. Basically, if you aren't familiar with them, uh, we go live over on Sarah's channel, which I will have all of the co-host channels linked down below. But yeah, we just go live on Sarah's channel, we read together, and um, you guys are able to chat with us in the comments, and it's a really good time. So um, the dates for those, I will pop them up on the screen, but all of the information will also be in the description box. But basically, we will be going live on Saturdays and Sundays. We do have a Google document that includes all of the general information, and then we also have a folder specifically for the Hello Spring Autumn readathon. We're going to have a folder as well for the other readathons, um, but we'll only have them posted during the time of that readathon, so you'll know exactly which folder to go to. Also in the description box, I will have a link to our Twitter. So now let's get into the Hello Spring Autumn Readathon. So this will be March 19th through the 20th. So yes, this will be a 48 hour readathon, um, but it's pretty relaxed. Um, we just wanna make sure that you know, don't feel pressure to um, stay up all night or, you know, just make sure you're prioritizing self-care and um, you can absolutely use the same book for both of the prompts if you would like. Just feel free to go at your own pace and to just have fun with it. So I will be welcoming in spring in March, so I will be doing the spring prompts. So the reading prompts for spring are a book with fresh starts and a book with a pastel cover. The bookstagram prompts are readathon TBR and spring book recommendations. Um, you can do this as an actual Instagram post, you can do a reel, you can put it on your story. Um, whatever it is that you'd like to do, uh, just feel free to get creative with it. I absolutely loved seeing all of your posts for the Hello 2022 readathon. That was just 
so much fun. And we also have an activity prompt, which is treat yourself with something just for you. Um, so you could also share this on your Instagram story, or if you are doing a reading vlog, feel free to include that in there. Um, so real quick, I wanted to share my TBR for this readathon. I don't know if I'm going to be able to read two books within the 48 hours, so I did pick a book that would fit both prompts just in case. So my first pick is How to Love Your Neighbor by Sophie Sullivan. Uh, this is a rom-com and this is about a girl named Grace. She has it all figured out. She's going to finish interior design school and most important, she'll have a place to belong. When an opportunity arises to fix up and live in a little house on the beach as her final design project, Grace is all in until her biggest roadblock moves in next door. Noah knows how to make a deal. As a real estate developer, he knows he's found something special, something he can even call home, provided he can expand by taking over the house next door, the house with the combative and beautiful woman living in it. With the rules for being neighborly out the window, Grace and Noah are in an all-out feud. But sometimes your nemesis can show you that home is always where the heart is. So like I said, I may only get around to reading one book, but then I also did pick a book for the Fresh Starts prompt. So for this, I have actually chosen a nonfiction book. Um, this is Goliath Must Fall by Louis Giglio. And I thought this would be great for the Fresh Starts prompt because this is about winning the battle against your giants. And nothing says a fresh start quite like overcoming something in your life. And then finally for the autumn prompts, we have for the reading prompts, a book with cozy vibes and a mystery. For the bookstagram prompts, we have readathon TBR and autumn goals slash bucket list. And for activity prompt, we have read while drinking your favorite autumn drink. So we have two hashtags that you can use. We have the hashtag hello spring autumn readathon, and then we also have the hello seasons readathons hashtag. So yeah, we are so excited to read with you and I can't wait to see what you guys choose for your TBR. Feel free to let me know in the comments down below if you wanna share your TBR. And yeah, I will see you guys again soon. Bye.